Hi everybody, welcome back to my video. My name's Michelle and you're watching Real Life with Michelle. Today, I'm going to talk to you about all the, the massagers and things I've bought along the years to help with my fibromyalgia and my back pain, neck pain, along with fibromyalgia comes achy body, achy back, achy neck, your neck joints hurt, every trigger point that you have hurts. Along with that, I also have a neck fusion. I've had two neck fusions and I have a rod in my spine. So that doesn't help matters at all. So let's get into this. First of all, I have this thing. Weird looking thing. And what this does, goes this way. You put it around your neck and it massages back on your, on your neck, on the, the trigger point spots go all around your neck and I love that I absolutely love this thing you could do your thighs I mean, you can't see me doing that but you can do that anywhere this thing reaches you could do I bought this off of Amazon I'll link it below but I absolutely love this thing I think it's under ten dollars and it it feels this is the bomb this this is the bomb I love this thing these are like hard balls rubbery hard balls and this is a hard bendable plastic love it love it love it okay next I have this thing all right I have used this thing it used to have a cover on it I have used this darn thing so much that the cover fell off I need to get a new one of these but what in the in the rubber ball everything fell off of this this is old I need a new one of these and this thing it plugs in the wall and these things spin, and what you do is you could lay on it, trigger point. You could do it, I use it on my back, I use this, I use this thing on everything. I still do use this thing, and this thing digs into me. It, it hurts, put a towel over it, I don't know. I need to get a new one of these. Love this thing too. I don't know, I'll link, all this stuff I show you, I'll link below. But this is all the stuff that I've tried. Hold on, let me go reach for this one. Oh, well, we'll go to this one. Another one is this thing. Love this thing, too. It vibrates. Trigger point. Well, let me say, I don't love this one as much because the vibration now with my spine, my rod, I can't, it's hard for me to do vibration. It's, so this thing, somebody might like this thing a lot. I kind of like it, but it's hard and the pressure vibrates great. All right. I also have a tens unit. I bought a little tens unit. I, for the life of me, I probably don't. I don't know where that thing is. Oh yes, I do. Hold on. I'll all be right. right back. Well, never mind that because I don't know where it is, and I'm not running all over my house searching for it. But it's a little tens unit. Um, has little sticky pads that you put on your back. Electrodes. You could turn it up and down, and it jolts you. That. I used to be able to use but now it, it aggravates my muscles too much and it puts me into a spasm so that's probably why I can't find it I don't use it all right <coughs> then 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 hold on okay this is a foot massager this is really cool it heats up home medics I use this thing on my feet I really really like this thing with the heat it, it just something about when you have fibromyalgia, here's a tip. Something about massaging your feet helps. I don't know what it is. I don't know why, but it really, really helps. Especially when I was working, I would, I would use this. This helps. Love this. I don't know what it is. Even when I was working, after work, I would go get a pedicure when my, my legs and my feet just ached. And every time I would get a pedicure, my legs would feel better for quite a while quite a while so that's another tip just go go get a pedicure if your legs are killing you try it it worked that worked for me all right so then I have my trusty heating pad just the little the little guy this I use on the daily on different spots I do use this I used to have a heating pad that was like a vest. I really liked that. It would go around your neck and, and clasp 
here. It was magnetic. I had that, really liked that, had it for a couple years and it broke. I should buy another one of those. That helped a lot because it had a little slop that got a little slop, a little like flap that went up to your neck. I like that a lot. All right, so then, oh, here, let me not forget this thing. I have this thing a foot massager. Like I said, the pedicure helped, so I thought I'm going to try this foot spa thing. And I really, really like this. I like this a lot. The only problem is I usually end up dumping the water. I, I don't know. I usually get water. Wherever I'm at using this is usually water around. Or the dog tries to come and drink the water. Look, I said the dog. Okay, go back. The dog will come try to drink the water out of the thing when I'm using it. And the cat jumps on me. And it's like, but I do, I do like that thing. It's a little messy though. All right. And then I got another thing. All right, this thing is the bomb. I don't know if you guys have probably never ever seen one of these. Look at this. This is a jade heating pad. I bought this off of Amazon in desperation one day. And this was a little bit pricier. But these little jade stones, they heat up. They all, all the jade stones heat up. And it penetrates your muscles differently. The jade, for some reason, makes the it penetrates deep into the muscles like the the regular heating pad this heats up your skin all right this just heats up your skin but when you add jade to it it's nice big leather thing when you add jade to this it it for some reason you could feel it deep in your muscles my husband even uses this he loves this thing it's it's a different kind of heat just a different kind of heat and normally, these things are all in the corner of the living room where I, I, like, you know, in the living room, you always have your spot that you sit in. It's your spot. Well, my spot in the corner of the couch area, I have all, the, I have all this stuff just sitting there. It's stacked neatly, you know, it doesn't look bad. But it's, it's just me and my husband here, and I, my visitors are my kids and my family, and I don't care who sees my, my little stuff sitting in the corner. I don't care. Okay, some other things I've tried for fibromyalgia. Let's see. Um, have you ever heard of drinking Alka-Seltzer? Something with the pH in your body is off and they say if you drink Alka-Seltzer, just plain regular Alka-Seltzer, it helps with your muscle pain. That helps a little bit, believe it or not. Seltzer water, Alka-Seltzer, just the plain Alka-Seltzer. For some reason, that that helps just a little bit. Um, I've tried oh a muscle rub that I really love. Asper cream makes a roll-on with lidocaine in it. That helps. And I've tried all of them. I've tried the sports cream, and I've tried the blues gel. I've tried I've tried them all. I've tried the patches. I've tried believe I've tried everything I have literally tried everything and the best thing I have found is the roll-on asper cream that's it I don't buy anything other than the roll-on asper cream now so that's it for today in another video maybe I'll get into the medications that I've used to to treat my fibromyalgia because believe me I have a big big list of them. I am a gold member at Rite Aid because I've had so many things that they like me. I guess they like me there. I don't know. All right. Well, this was just a short little video to just show you maybe to help you if you have different pains. Remember, this thing is the bomb. This thing, love it. I, I just love this thing. It, just, it feels really good. And hey, props to my massage therapist, Chris. Love her. I go see her. Well, I haven't seen her recently, but every two weeks for there for a while, I was seeing Chris, and that helps too, massage therapy. So, love you, Chris. All right, well, I'll see you later. Like, and don't forget to subscribe, and come back for more of these crazy videos. Who knows what I'm going to film next. Bye.